she was a virtuous person. She was a courageous woman. She founded a religious community for women of color before the Civil War in a slave state. The Ablate Sisters of Providence pray every day for Mother Mary Lang to become a saint. The Pope signed the decrees recognizing her heroic virtues June 22nd. Mother Lang was born in Cuba to Haitian parents and came to the United States around 1813, settling in Fells Point. She saw how black children and other immigrants needed education and founded St. Francis Academy. What was getting this news like for you? I just felt all kinds of emotions uh, swelling up within me, and then I began to share the good news. And it, it is indeed good, good news. I got filled up this morning because we've been waiting for such a long time. The road to becoming a saint started in 1991 when William Cardinal Keeler, with the approval of Rome, officially opened the formal investigation into her life. Superior General Sister Rita Proctor says she has two more steps to go. What happens next is blessed. Before Mother Lion can be declared blessed, she must perform a miracle in her through her intercession. And once that has been thoroughly examined, and approved, then she's moved to the next step, which is sainthood, with a miracle, another miracle. Both sisters say Mother Lang is so deserving of sainthood. Whatever she thought God was calling her to do, she followed that, regardless of what other people, organizations might say or do. In our hearts, in, our, in the many lives, we know the work that Mother Lang did was for the honor and glory of God, which were some of her words. Uh, do all you can for the glory and honor of God, and we know it will happen in God's time. The sisters ask that everyone pray for her canonization. Lisa Robinson, WBAL-TV 11 News.